There's more, there's more. Okay. Oh, he's pushing up, huh? Oh, I'm lagging out. No. Hello everybody, my name is Vexera, and today we take an adventure into the world of Deadside. Deadside is an early access, hardcore, multiplayer survival shooter similar to things like DayZ, except this one makes me hate myself just a little less. I went into Deadside thinking it was going to be an easy time, just expected to run around, kill some easy AI to get some cool gear, and just kind of chill. And right off spawn, I was shown that this was going to be a very different experience than I had initially thought. Whoa. Is that a me? Holy, okay. Already? Jeez. Uh... There's more. Holy, that guy's got a shotgun, okay. Ow! Shoot. I did get a cool shotgun out of this altercation, though, so that made it kind of worth it. Now, knowing me, I couldn't just sit in one place, so I made the very smart decision to head towards another one of the coastal towns in hopes of going from there to this heli crash that was showing on the map. There looks to be a helicopter? Helicopter crash, about three kilometers away. I mean, I kind of want to go for it. I mean, if, if, okay, we're going to head that direction. If it's there still, like when we get there, and we'll try to take it. Because obviously, that is something I can do with just a shotgun, pistol, and a tracksuit. But to no one's surprise, I ended up getting sidetracked along the way. What is up here? What am I looking at? I know I said I'd go to the town, but I want to see what's going on up here. What is this? Oh, it's a railroad tunnel. Huh. That doesn't exactly take us to where we want to go, but... I mean, we can go through it anyways, just out of curiosity. What am I, wait, what is that? Shoot. Oh no. Crap. S85? Is it like a hunting? It's a it's a sniper rifle and it has a scope on it. I, I mean, shoot, let's let's take it. Let's take the one with the scope. This one has a scope and a flashlight. The fight in the tunnel left me with an S85 rifle with a scope on it and plenty of ammo to help me get to my next destination. Speaking of which, I finally made my way over to the next town, which ended up being a massive waste of time. I don't see anything. Like at all. More machine oil. Man, this place is absolutely empty. That sucks. After searching through the town and finding basically nothing, I started making my way towards the crash site, but it turned out that wasting time looking through an empty town actually had its blessings. Another crash site showed up right behind me, and if I had skipped looting the town, I would have completely missed the opportunity. Wait, no way. I guess we're, we're shifting gears. This one just spawned in. 539 meters away. Oh, screw that one. We got to go for this one. No way. I mean, all right. What? <laughs> I mean, okay. This crash was in a much better position for taking out the guards, but it still ended up being pretty challenging considering the fact that I'm just not that good at video games. It's in a good spot too. Right at the bottom of this mountain. Might be able to take out whoever's on it from a distance. Oh, I see one. Crap, I missed. That's one. Is that it? That hurt. Shoot. I'm at 27 health. Crap, I might not be able to take these guys on. Let's push back. Crap, they see me. Oh no. Reload. 
Please reload faster. Holy! I was at a serious disadvantage going against the squad at the crash site, but somehow I was able to come out alive. Now, I expect to get some decent loot out of this, but I had no clue how good it would actually end up being. Oh. My. What? The guns, ammo, attachments, everything here was more than enough. Honestly, if I could just find some armor, then we'd be good. I decided to head further inland in hopes of coming across more helicopter crashes, airdrops, or even just a traitor, but I got interrupted along the way. Oh my, okay. Shoot. Oh, here he comes. We're getting shot at. Crap. Run. Oh no. Oh boy, okay. Oh man. Alright, let's go this way. Oh my. Shoot. I've gotta take that place. I need to. I say we push along this left side. Maybe we can get further up the mountain behind him. Let's do it. Try not to get killed. Shoot. Here they come. Oh boy, here we go. Reload, reload, reload. At first, this looked to be a standard military base, but upon further inspection, I realized that there were bunker-type structures that led me underground. I guess, uh, in we go. Shoot! A lot of dead bodies here. Dude, how many are there? This fight was the biggest one I'd had so far, and I was lucky to be alive still. So, after clearing what I thought was everyone, I got the hell out of there. But one horrible decision on the way out ended up leading me to something insane. Oh, they see me now. Let's go. Ow. Never mind. Let's not go. I, I give up. Never mind. Oh, this is a key. What? What is this? VG25's dude. And then this is for a 50 cal. Dude. Uh. Uh. <laughs> okay. After finding the box I'd completely missed on the way in, I had no choice but to take this loot and make my way to the safe zone to find a trader. I cannot believe we have a freaking grenade launcher. Hey, we made it. We're in the safe zone now. This is worth 40,000. 
Dude. <laughs> this had been the biggest payday I'd ever had while playing Deadside. Although it might not be much to some of you watching, this was a huge win for my first day on the server. And I found this to be the perfect way to end my play session. Thank you guys so much for watching the video, I really hope you enjoyed it. If you have Dead Sight, I really urge you to hop on and play. A friend of mine named Blue the Robot has a server called Blue Blood, it was what I was playing on in this video, so if you want to get in on some of the fun, just search up Blue Blood in the server browser and hop on in. If you manage to find me anywhere in the world, you can expect to be submitted to a life of slavery to help me complete missions and get cool stuff. Have a great day, week, month, and year, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Трассера летят, и от разрыва вся дрожит.